crystals. Yeah, I've done my mugs. And I've had to, because I'm obviously doing my GCSEs again, especially English. Yeah. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Obviously, as I've just mentioned, I'm going to be talking about mock results and what I got for my mocks. Because anyone who is new to my channel or hasn't watched my GCSE results video, I got a three in English. And yeah, and I say originally because it got re one of my English language papers got remarked, and I got a grade four because I went to. So I'm very happy about that. But I'm still having to retake English. So I failed literature, past language. So I'm okay with that. Like language is the more important one. So yeah. And I'm just gonna kind of give my mock results to you guys. For anyone of you who's curious, I'll do like a separate video on like my plans for future like university courses I'm looking at that sort of thing but this video is going to be all related to my mock results 2019 jeez I didn't do mock results 2018 I don't even know what they were but yeah and in my GCC results video I wore a black clip got so much hate for it so I brought back the black clip because I don't care but yeah I look also, I don't have like a specific sheet with them on, but I did, ha they were on my university college, like, system, so, did I say university, did I just say university college system? I mean, it was on my, it was on the college system, whereas I believe I said university college system. Don't even know. But yeah, so let's start off with... English and for English I'm pretty sure I got a four I'm gonna need to go check I'm gonna need to check now because I can't remember <sighs> yeah I believe I got a four or five it was one of those I will kind of edit that into which one like I'll edit it into this corner which one I got but yeah I got either a four or a five which I'm happy with because I definitely know it was a four or a five but I'm happy with that because it's mock like it's January like slash though Basically, that mock exam I did in the last week of January, so I've got a chance to improve to either a grade 5 or a grade 6, which, oh my god, a grade 6. <laughs> that would be incredible, which means, I got, which means I would end up having the same grade as I got for maths. My first week back in January, I did my English speaking and listening exam and that was the actual GCSE and I got a distinction I didn't I don't think I mentioned my English language not English language I don't think I've mentioned my speaking and listening in my GCSE results but if I didn't I got a merit in those that exam I got a distinction this time so I've improved but then again this time I got more free will on what I wanted to speak about so so in my 28 in 28 like last year I did I spoke about Jack the Ripper because we had to choose something related to one of our texts this year I could choose anything I wanted so I spoke about body confidence and I got distinctions so yeah but then again for body confidence I could talk about anything or I could just give my opinion whereas it Talking about Jack the Ripper, it was facts. So I'm better at giving opinion than facts. We now know that about me. But yeah, that's English. For sociology, I got a grade three, 
and I know that's a grade before pass but if I'm getting a grade three now it means I should get a grade four minimum in my exam so that's obviously great and out of sociology and psychology sociology is my favorite even though everyone else in my class prefers psychology but I don't know there's just something about sociology that I prefer but yeah and then psychology let's talk about the elephant in the room I got a one Psychology is not the one I enjoy the most, it's my least enjoyed, and I guess, and this is where I'm going to get hate, it was because I didn't do the most revision, because I was so busy revising sociology that I forgot about psychology. Yeah. Give me all the hate in the world. But there's bound to be people that you know that have done that, or at least people that you went to school with that did that, so. Don't give me too much hate, please. But yeah, also, I realised, I've just kind of realised, even though I realised this morning, but then I re-realised now, I'm wearing the exact same top for in this video as I did in my GCSE results video. So, I might wear this in my GCSE results 2019 video, let's just keep it going. And I might rock that clip again. But yeah, and I actually, giving a little story time here, it's a very mini story time, I actually wore the black lipstick to school on results day. Yes, I did. I rocked the black clip. And yes, I know the black clip isn't the neatest. And I'm pretty sure I heard someone comment being like, I love the black clip. So yeah. That's my mini story time. I wore black lipstick to results day in front of everybody, which is obviously. Yeah. And in this video, I'm going to give my prediction of what I will get for my, my GCSE exams. Also, my results video, I will make like in my 2019 results video I will kind of mention my other results just so that anyone who watches it then who are new will kind of know the backstory and will just know my other results but my predictions are for English oh god I predicted five I predicted five last year for English and um got a three but I ended up getting a four after remark but I'm aiming for a grade five, but I do now know what it means by make a description on a story. Just don't use the word up, just don't use I. Or we yeah. So I think I'll do a lot better. For sociology, I'm gonna predict a four, just because I got, on my, exam I got 40 out of the 100 and that was a grade 3 almost a grade 4 but still that was a grade 3 and if I'd have got like 50% it would have been a grade 4 so I was very close to grade and if you think about exams 40 out like 40 marks it was like eh also there is two sociology exams but yeah and I've only done one of them because we've only learnt half the content we've only learnt paper one content so far and that reminds me I need to do some revision and then for sociology I'm not sociology psychology I'm going to be a little bit ambitious and I'm going to say a grade three I think what that gets me down is like the studies 
and I think on my exam I got like 25 or something out of 87 yeah I don't know what exactly the mark was but I know I got 33% so one of 33% of 85 is that's my score do I have my exam in there I can't remember probably do but yeah so those are my predictions and my mock ex results and if you guys enjoyed this video and want to see more videos about my education and want to see that video on to do with what I want to do with the future possible uni, uni courses or universities I want to go I might want to attend and also if you want me to do like a talking about pricing of accommodation for different unis then just let me know because I will happily do that because I love researching costs of accommodation and like the cheapest accommodation and that sort of thing and if you want that then just let me do let me know in the comment section and let's try and get this video to 10 likes so go and hit that like button and yeah I will see you guys in my next video bye